Enable or disable auto save by scrolling to help the screen in the menu, then selecting settings. Okay. Yes, I would like to sleep. I wonder if that's the new uh, Scyther form. Maybe. That'd be cool. Good morning, Sam. Are you up? Quite some lightning last night, wasn't it? Today's the day of your trial, so uh, now let's give it our all. Alright. Go to the Galaxy Team headquarters for the trial. Yee. What lovely weather we've got. Nice small child. I hope you had a nice sleep, even if this land is strange and new to you. Let's get to headquarters. Captain Selena's waiting. Alright, bet. Damn. They really are super scared of Pokemon, man. The amount of clothes she's wearing and, like, these guys are wearing is kind of wild. Point of wild. Sorry, I keep checking in my camera in this spot. The Survey Corps' office are here on the first floor. Don't give up, keep your those eyes open. The wild Pokemon, they 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 were everywhere, attacking from all sides. I sat on my partner Pokemon, but against a whole pack outnumbered. Oh, this is what happens when you go so far afield. But the medical corps will put you right to uh, put you to rights. That man's with the security corps, and even with his own po partner. He took a beating from wild Pokemon. Without a partner Pokemon of your own, you might find this trial particularly trying. Captain Selene, Sam is here. Let me enter. Fishfish always here. Dude, I feel like we're in the Oval Office. That is an aberrant, by the way, if you can see that. Let us get straight to it. If you wish to join the Galactic or Galaxy Expedition Team, prove yourself capable by going out into the Obsidian uh, Field lands and catching three different species of Pokemon. Bidoof, Starling, and Shinx. Catching three Pokemon from the start? No one in Galaxy Team has ever managed that. Wow, these guys are news. Did the stranger not catch three different Pokemon already in the my trial should be simple enough for him if the first professor wasn't exaggerating things that is. The Galaxy team does not have the means to provide for those only who will take the giving. If you wish to stay, you must prove beyond any doubt that you'll be an asset to our cause. I will lend you one of our survey core statues to carry whatever you may need in the field. Alright. Damn, I got a little backwards fanny pack though. <laughs> it's lit. That satchel? Oh, sorry. That satchel doesn't exactly match your, uh, mode of dress. Akari, I'll expect you to step in if anything goes hard. Alright, Galaxy Team Entry Trial. Checking missions and requests. Press the Y button while I'll consult the Okay. Pardon, Sam. Come with me a moment. Now then, a jolly good morning to everyone. Is something the matter, Professor Levington? In order to complete our Pokedex and, well, simply survive in this unforgiving land, Sam absolutely must pass this trial. And as a professor of Pokemon, I jack just the ticket to help accomplish that. Oh, Come on, Sam. Pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy. With a partner of your own, you'll be able to fight off wild Pokemon outside the village. These little darlings are very dear to me, but it's plain to see that they're 
rather curious about that. Well, my boy, which Pokemon would you like to keep as your very own? Oh man. My little man Rowlet right there with his bow tie. Wait, can't. Will Akari say what she had? They're all so lovely. Okay, she will not. I'm going with Cyndaquil, because when do I ever go with Cyndaquil? Yes, I do! Look at little mans. Damn, why does Ashawa look so sad? Okay, now I feel bad. And with that, one of the Pokemon you caught at Prelude Beach for me that will now be yours to keep. Good show, I tuck Cyndaquil back inside his football for you, so take it, it's yours. Dude, why are you so tall, by the way? I get him only 15. Ghost, what is up? I see you spinning that. Word of advice, my boy. Pay close attention to which Pokeballs are empty and which ones contain a Pokemon when you're out in the field. They look as if they're cheering on their friends in the Yo, Ashwa looks so sad though. Or perhaps they're jealous that it gets to help the yeah, they were, yeah. They're definitely a little upset. That could be well, or that could well be. They did go dashing from the village when the sand fell out of the sky. I still think that's weird. Well, not to worry you two, I'll have you assist with me with my research. By the by, what species has Captain Celine charged you with catching? Well, that's smashing all three of those species can be found in the obsidian field lanes. Let me give you some Pokeballs to use during your trial. Yo, how many more did you give me? 20? So I have like 70 or something. These Pokeballs may be handcrafted, but they work as a treat, as you've already seen. You'll have this trial cleared in no time. I guess you're finally ready. You'll have to leave the village for your trial turn left after you exit headquarters and head for the gate. Alright. Guess what? Alright, let's go see what's out there. Let's see it. Alright. Oh no, he took my football from earlier. Yo, how the hell did Akari beat me here, though? That's the real question. God damn it. Man, there's so many voices, I'm not good at voices. Oh, what a curious get up you have there. I can. It's literally the same professor voice, dude. Whatever. I can already tell you're quite the character. I'm a Volo of the Ginkle Guild. The go to choice for any of your merchant. merchant mercantile needs here in Hisui. I heard talk about you. Fell from the sky, didn't you? Now, that's certainly a tale I'd like to hear. Oh, and you have a Pokemon. You're certainly full of interesting surprises. Yo, Cameron, what is up? Investigating the odd and novel is key to any good merchant's success. So, what do you say? How about you and I see our Pokemon stand up to one in a battle? Bring it the fuck on, brother. I like you better and better. What a delightful fun. I've also heard about this trial year to attend. Let's have a quick battle to get your blood pumping before you head out. Though I know... Wait, though I hope you know if you'll lose, your Pokemon's HP reaches zero. Dude, I've, I've been seeing some people doing some, uh... Uh, Nuzlocke over here. I don't know how to do that. Yo, Cameron, thanks for the follow on that. Appreciate it. Uh... Oh wait, this was, this was the guy in the picture that we saw. Alright. Yo, but the real question is. Oh, well, what <laughs> can we look at that? Uh, all we have is quick death. Oh, it's a crit even! Okay, is that? Yeah, that's him up there. Yo, put it there. Oh. I forgot this, uh... Game was up with the... With the... Because Tokopedia needs to move there. And I got to move twice. 
Moves, items, use them well, and the world will open up. Oh shit! New move! You don't even tell me what the move is. Okay, nice. It's always good to have fun with your Pokemon and do battle, don't you think? And as they gain experience through battle, they'll learn more moves and grow even stronger. You might sometimes learn new moves if you want to change the moves your Pokemon can use in battle. We know that stuff. But so few people here have their own Pokemon. If only more knew how to use Pokemon. At any rate, let me help our two battles recover. Battlers recover from their little exercise. That's weird that everyone fears Pokemon, but like this guy's like, yeah, let me just heal him. And to you, my scholarly fallen friend, I present some potions in them. Nice. Uh, 60 HP to a single. Uh, you can use them on your Pokemon whenever they might be worn out from battle. I'll be hoping that you're successful on that trial of yours. More Galaxy team members means more customers for yours truly, after all. Yeah, I get how that is. I used to be a salesman as well, Brother Bear. That's really something, not only can you... Oh, sorry. That's really something! Not only can you catch Pokemon, you can lead them in battle! Now to the Obsidian Fieldlands! When you're leaving Jubilee Village, make sure that you choose the destination from your map and tell Rex the Guardmans where you're going. That way someone can come to your aid if you're knocked out by a Pokemon. Okay. Yo, those men's freaking cybers. Oh, okay, so I have to talk to you. You're Sam, correct? I was informed you'd be passing through. Your trial will take place outside the safety of the village. Please take care to come back alive. Damn. I wonder how many areas there are in this game, then. Alright, Obsidian and Fieldlands. Oh, I can zoom in. Oh! I see. Alright, well, yeah, that's, uh... There's a good amount of areas, for sure. Alright, cool. Let's go to the Fieldlands camp. Wow, this is literally a camp. This is our base camp, the last safe haven before you reach the wilds. For your trial, you must catch three species of Pokemon, Bidoof, Starly, and Shinx. Are you ready to get started? Oh, Professor, is something wrong? Ah, well, you see, Captain Selene got a hold of me after you left. She impressed upon me that I bear full responsibility for whatever happens to our sudden guest. That's our unsparing Captain. But what help exactly can you offer out here, Professor? To be honest, my dear girl, I do, or I don't, intend to lift a finger. Sam's talents are the real deal. He'll pass what flying colors you see. Ah, so the responsibility for him still lies, in fact, with me, then. Well, I'm sure Sam will be fine. Let's begin the trial. Alright, let's do it. Let's go! Catch a Bidoof, the first Pokemon species you need for the trial. Uh, do I come over by you first here, or... I guess so. This is Aspiration Hill. The species of Pokemon you're meant to catch all live here. Obsidian field lands. There it is. Nice. And along comes a Bidoof. Time to get those Pokeballs up. Okay. The key to is to aim carefully. Not that you seem to need my advice. I'm just sharing what I know. All right. Focusing in the field. Hold down the ZL button to focus on wild Pokemon, and keep it in your sights as long as it's nearby. This technique comes in very useful when aiming Pokeballs at a target or when dodging Pokemon attacks. The Doof has a mellow disposition, that means it tends not to run from people, so this will be easy. Okay. Yo, should I like sneak up on it or like what? Alright, I'm down. Yo, we gotta get the high ground. Excuse me, I'm literally right here, motherfucker. Hello. 
pulled the Z Oh, okay. So it's like auto aim. Stay in the ball, motherfucker. Hey. That's a Bidoof. It's lit. You caught a Bidoof. Well done. Time to find your next Pokemon. Damn. Catch a Starly, the second Pokemon species you need for your I saw one down there. There's a Starly. They're skittish little things. They'll run if startled. Dude, Seraphir is so fucking sick, though. But you should be able to get close to them. If you crouch, you'll be harder to spot. Alright, crouching down. Press the B button to crouch and make it harder for wild Pokemon to notice. You press the, the same button to, again to rise. If you creep in the tall grass while crouch low, you'll be able to... Uh, It'll be even harder for wild Pokemon to detect. Uh, okay. Uh, it's not letting me focus. That's okay. That was a pretty good toss right there. Yeah. Alright, alright. That star they caught as well, only one more Pokemon to go! Alright, now catch a Shinx. Alright. Where is it at? Is it by the bridge? What was that? I forgot, there's something I ought to teach you since you're still new to this. Alright, what is that? Use the proper way to throw your partner's Pokeball. As Captain Selene tells us, have an item at the ready, but want to send out a Pokemon, press X. Okay. Have an item at the ready, but want to throw an item. Wait. Okay. The Captain's a real expert on these things. Try throwing your Pokemon's ball at rocks or trees like this one to have it investigate. If your Pokemon finds any berries or other items, it will bring them to you. Now it's time for your po uh, partners to shine. We've reached your final hurdle, catching a Shinx. Okay, so, next. Ah! Oh yeah, I already have these guys up there. Okay, cool, cool. Alright, investigate that. Okay! Oh, you get experience for that too? No, so what, I can just investigate Oh. Hello. What's up, little man? Okay, so then I can just take it back like that. Alright, cool. Oh, and then I have an orange berry. Okay, so I'm guessing this is like a lure berries in this game. There! Shinx! Okay. These ones, yeah. Shinx has an aggressive disposition. Could you already tell that? I thought you might. I can never tell until I focus on a Pokemon carefully. Once aggressive Pokemon get irate, they'll knock aside any ball you throw at them. Okay, when you use the ZL button to focus on a Pokemon, you can see how easy it may be to catch. Okay, the more arrows you see pointing up, uh, up above a Pokemon, the easier it will be to catch. Okay. An X icon will appear above a Pokemon if it has picked a fight with you. Be warned, Pokemon displaying this icon cannot be caught unless you engage in the battle. Don't worry though, I'll teach you the trick to catching aggressive Pokemon. You've got to battle them. Once they've absorbed with battling, you can throw a Pokeball at them to try and catch them. By now, you've got several Pokemon of your own, don't you? Take one of those Pokeballs and throw it near a wild Pokemon you want to battle. Dude, this is literally like Pixelmon, but a Pokemon, yeah. I've got no doubt you'll hold your own in battle. I literally just smacked someone up before or something fun. Uh, it's pretty. It's easy to start a battle against wild Pokemon. Simply throw a Pokeball that contains one of your Pokemon at it. If you see that uh, that you currently have an ready item to throw, um, oh yeah, oh excuse me, uh, do the uh, quick swap. All right. Oh, they see me. Hold on. Okay. Put up your freaking dudes, bitch. Let's go. <laughs> you are level. Yo, I love that you can run around. Uh, okay. Let me 
well. Eat. So I don't have to cross it in battle. You caught it? You approached these Pokemon without a hint of fear and caught each one. You're like a gift that Sky dropped to us. With you at our side, I think the Survey Corps has a real chance of compiling a complete Pokédex as we've been ordered. This is wonderful. I'm still curious on why on earth you came falling from the sky like you did, but for now, let's tell the professor we're ready to head back. Uh, I don't really want to head back. I want to explore the world, but... If you so think I should go back. Yeah. Oh! I said you'd pass the trial with flying colors, and it seems you went and did just that. Congratulations, Sam. You've taken your first step towards seeking out every Pokemon. This calls for a commemorative photograph. Okay. Kinda cringe. Who takes a photograph of your eyes closed? Okay. Okay. With skills like yours, I suppose this was a foregone conclusion. Oh, that was a hard fought. Now then, we best report to Captain Selene. Time to head back to Jubilee Village, eh? Let's head on back, motherfucker. In time, you'll be able to send Pokemon you've caught to live in the village pastures. You can bring up to six Pokemon with you into the field, in theory, though we've never had anyone skilled enough to do so. Come now, you two. That's not Dilly Dally. Captain Selena awaits our reports at headquarters. I, can't, I bet Captain Selim will be very pleased. Alright. Let's go see what awaits us. I wonder if, like, just after this, they're going to just let us go. Spoiled. I said a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you believe it. This is yours, the official uniform of the survey court. Alright, we get some new, drip. some new drip. You received a survey court uniform, a pair of survey court sandals. Get changed in the room that you used last night, then report. Uh, you have to report at, to, at once to the third floor. Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official command uh, order from your captain. Ready to get a new uniform? Make sure you use the mirror angle. I can do that. All right, so do that quick. Um, yo, where do I go to heal though? Uh, yo, let's check out some Pokemon. Cyndaquil. Um, are there a uh, serious nature? Okay. Okay, so it's a neutral nature. Okay, okay, okay. Blue, Starly, Shanks. Huh? It's not a bad nature on Shanks. Starly's doesn't really matter. Eh, Bidus is okay. We have speed and attack and special defense. I'm guessing those are IVs. Okay, cool. Alright, let's uh, go in here. Let's get our fit going. Let's see what's up. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. True. Alright, change outfit. Alright. Oh. I didn't realize it was not going to do that. Okay. Survey core uniform. Then we need them chonk brothers. Damn, those are some interesting looking sandals. That's all I've got to say. All right, finish changing. Ooh, that was the A button. Yes. All right, cool. 
Damn, we looking fly for a white guy, as they say. I don't want a hat. I don't want a hat. A hat would be cool. Uh, I am recording, right? I am recording. Good. I forgot to put on performance mode, so hopefully the video doesn't look like awful garbage. Anyway, look how well our Survey Corps uniform sorts you. Trying to flirt there, Carney? Kind of weird, though. It's almost as if the captain had it tailored just for you. I see you changed. Regarding the accommodations, you may continue to use the room you stuck in that site. You may wear this sweat. Hey, we got my hat. Let's go. Now present yourself to the commander. The commander. Alright, so we need the third floor, not the second. Brave new land we're living in, which means there's a whole lot to do. Oh, an Eevee! I don't know if I really want to talk to it. I wonder what all those uh, different symbols are going to be. Yo, look at this guy's mustache. Next from his sideburns. Oh no, it does not. Never mind. I, I have been waiting for you. I'm Kamado, commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. So you are sent. It's an honor. Know your manners at least. I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Try to throw him and charge at him. Uh, let's charge at him, I guess. Hiya! You got bigger of that. You need to work on your sumo technique, but I do see some potential. Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some will be slow to trust an outsider who literally fell right out of the blue. The superstitious among us might see your arrival as a portent of disaster. But you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how odd you may seem, you're part of Jubilee Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition team and complete the Pokemon text. I warn you, Sam, Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you as you work. Hey, 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 first mission done. It's lit. So, the commander has also accepted you. Understand this, you begin as a, a no star recruit on, on our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. Perform well as a member of the Survey Corps and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed, you see, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. And working on the Pokedex will also, of course, bring you closer toward the goal of yours to seek out every last Pokemon. Here, you will need this. You obtained a uh, recipe for drafting Pokemon. Oh, yeah. So one Abercorn and one Pumple Stone. Okay. And three thousand dollars as well. You will have to buy the necessary materials. Eight. Akari, you are an expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruits what you need to know. Of course, Captain Selene. Now, as the experienced craftsperson here, let me explain a bit to Sai. Crafting means making items with your own two hands. You can buy some items at the general store, but sell them sufficiently is worth striving for. You can even make lots of valuable tools. Puppy balls! Think where we'd be if we couldn't do that. Let's head to the craft workshop. Right. 